Our top story tonight, Winnebago County's coroner leaving the courtroom this morning in handcuffs. Bill Hintz first faced charges of theft and forgery in 2020 and got slapped with even more charges of stealing from the dead in 2021. He faced several years of jail time heading into court today and tens of thousands in fines. But a plea deal changed all of that today. Instead of dozens of charges, Hintz only pled guilty to two of them. He was booked for theft from Winnebago County and official misconduct. He's going to go to jail for six months and then serve more than six years of probation after he leaves prison. He will pay back more than $30,000 that he stole from the county. And as of today, he is no longer the Winnebago County coroner. But more on that in a moment. Because first, we are going to be digging deeper into how investigators caught hint stealing from the county. Prosecutors say it all started with a confusing enterprise bill found by county staff in 2020. Hintz explained it was for a death investigation conference in New York, but after studying it, investigators say they believe that conference never existed. Instead, his charges lined up with the location and times of his son's hockey games. Police found two specific examples where Hintz made up conferences to attend his kids' games on the county's dime. Hint saying today he's sorry for the shame he's brought to his family and the county, but Judge Joseph McGraw says Hintz's guilt goes further than just stealing money. It's a betrayal of everyone who voted for you. It's a betrayal of everyone who supported you in your election. Uh, and it speaks to the wider problem society-wide. People are losing confidence in elected officials. With Hintz gone, what happens to the coroner's office? According to the county, a replacement is going to be made within the next two months. That person has to be a Republican since Hintz won the 2020 election as a Republican. Whoever is appointed will serve until November when there is going to be a special election to elect a new coroner. That person can either be a Republican or Democrat. Now that person is going to serve the last two years of Hintz's term until the next election in 2024. Hintz's wife, Michelle Hintz, is in court tomorrow. She's implicated in the same theft and forgery charges as Bill. We'll continue to track any developments from that case as they become available.